What is going on everyone and welcome back to GAA Fan TV. Limerick have done it again, they have won another major honour at Crow Park, this time the National Hurling League title. They beat Waterford by 8 points, 124 to uh, 19 points. A very dominant display in the end by Limerick, absolutely fantastic from them to win yet another major trophy at Crow Park. Of course, you know, who would have thought this time last year that Limerick would go on not only to win the All-Ireland, but, you know, to win it in such incredible fashion, you know, beating teams like Galway, Kilkenny, Cork along the way, you know, three of the other um, favourites, of course. And, um, you know, here they are again, National Hurling League champions. And, you know, they are definitely the dominant force at the moment in hurling. And, you know, it, it, hurling's a very competitive sport at the moment. You've a number of teams that could really go into the All-Ireland Championship and win the All-Ireland but Limerick are certainly the team that are delivering at the moment. They are the team that's winning and they are the team that is putting in the performances. And in terms of this game, you know, I have to say full credit to Limerick because, you know, they dominated from the from, from the early minutes. They kept control of the game. One thing that very you know really impresses me about this Limerick team is, is just their energy levels, their intensity, their work rate. I mean, this team just don't seem to get tired. I mean, even in the final minutes, closing down, not giving Waterford space. Um, and what that meant was Limerick dominated possession because they they almost pressed high up the pitch on Waterford. They, you know, they, they stopped them from from poking the ball very high up the field, or, or, or sorry, playing it from from player to player, passing it around. Um, and Waterford had to had to keep hitting it long, and, and that meant they lost possession of 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 the slitter, of course. And um, you know, in the end, Limerick were were very comfortable in possession, and and, and they took the majority of the chances that came their way. Um, wonderful goal by Aaron Galan, wonderful pass by Morrissey, flicked in by Galan. Um, he tried to downplay it, of course, in the interview after, saying he didn't really know a lot about it. But you cannot take away the, you know, just a wonderful quality of play at times between Limerick, um, and you know, still a very young team as well. You know, they definitely have a lot of potential. This Limerick team to to really dominate um, the sport, absolutely no doubt about it. Um, you know, Waterford tried to come back into it in the second half, but. I'm not sure, they just they played within themselves a bit in this game, Waterford. This wasn't the same Waterford I felt that we've seen. They played Dublin last weekend um, and, you know, that put in some fantastic performances throughout this league campaign. You know, Austin Gleeson, I thought, didn't quite have his best game today. Um, he played very, you know, further back in the pitch. He didn't play, play quite high up, um, which was kind of the way Waterford set out. I don't know if they tried to stifle the limit, tried to be a bit more defensive. Um, but it just didn't work because Waterford, as I said, kept hitting the ball long, and and couldn't really do anything with it. The only player, one of you know, a few players did play well, obviously for Waterford, but probably their standout player was Stephen Bennett. I thought he was you know the driving force a bit more in the first half and in the second half. But you know they did fluff their lines quite a bit. Waterford, you know they they, they started trying to hit it long and and all this you know trying to hit points from you know stupid angles and stuff. But in the end, Limerick were were far more superior. Dan Morrissey, Tom Morrissey again, um, just like they were in the All Ireland final in August, they were outstanding in this game as well. So you know, fair play to Limerick, huge result for them, National Hurling League champions, and you know, I'd, I'd look at them as, as huge favourites now for the All Ireland title this year. Anyway, guys, that is the end of the video. If you are new around here, do drop a like, subscribe, all that stuff, and yeah, I will see you all next time.